Hello, good people of YouTube. Mountbatten here, and welcome back to Boat Crew. So, Boat Crew is a game that's set during World War II. You're in command of a PT boat during the war, and you get to customize your boat, customize your crew, and take the fight to the Imperial Japanese uh, Navy. Now, uh, what's really cool about boat crews is that you can get into a lot of the goofiness that was going on with the Mosquito Fleet during World War II with uh, some of the crazy loadouts that were being fitted to these, you know, small fiberglass and wooden hull boats. And uh, Boat Crew just had a major update that has increased some of this goofiness. Uh, you might notice that the front of this PT boat is fitted with a 3-inch gun. That's, um... Yeah, so we're going to be playing Boat Crew more today, taking a look at the update. It's been about a year since this game was originally featured on the channel. There have been several smaller updates since then, but this is, to my knowledge, the first big update since the initial launch of Boat Crew and Early Access on Steam. So let's go ahead and, well, head on out into uh, the wild, shall we? Actually, this is kind of the over map for a Boat Crew. Um... You send your boat about um, via this map, and you you know run into various uh, various engagements here. As you can see, there is a bit of a, an assault going on at Tulagi. Um, our side has more than enough uh, support to beat them, but oh, it's over. Okay, there you go. It's over before we got there. So this is the. Um, let me go ahead and pause the game. This is the map that you can well explore and liberate uh, from the Japanese control as you can see uh, we've got most of this island down here done um, but we, we got our work cut out for us right so and the Japanese can come and they can you know take these bases that we've taken uh, we can go in and you know try and liberate some of these islands uh, let's go ahead and actually let's go down here let's help help out Malapa and see what we can do now um, my boat if you might have noticed I have no uh, typed. Oh yeah, look, we are assaulting this right now. Let's go. We have no um, healing. We have no extra ammo, so we're kind of just all gas and no brakes right here. Let's see where is. Ooh, I got to remember the controls now. Yeah, there's our our guys. Look at that nice little invasion force. So where are the Japanese at? So according to the report, we're just attacking base defenses. So there should be some fortified positions or something about. I think there's a guard tower over there. Yeah. And over to my left, you can see the crew in their various uh, states. Um, old boy in the back, I forgot to give him a gun, so he's just ready to throw hands. We have Bill the BAR guy here, fan favorite from last time. Oh, there they are. All right, get them, boys. Go! Look at the front, entire front of the boat rocks. That that is an amazing fire rate, fellas. So we do have a set of. Whoa! What was that? That was like some uh, Merv-looking thing. Whoa! Oh, okay. Well, that's unfortunate. All right. Well, let's hope that uh, they don't realize that our half of our crew's off of the boat right now. Uh oh, they realize. Alright, come on, come on, come on. Get on the wheel. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Woohoo! Oh. Trying to. Whoa! Is that honeycomb shell or whatever? Yeah, that's a big gun. Oh, okay. So they have. Six Type A landing boats, three motor gun boats, two floating tanks, and one Mutsuki. Ah. Let's go bully a Mutsuki, shall we? Ow, 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 ow. Mutsuki got hands, yeah. Hmm. Hey, he's sinking, though. <laughs> so, as you guys can tell, sometimes things don't go right. But we, we sunk the Mutsuki. That's okay. We're 3,000 over budget, but I have the exact same loadout as last time. I don't know what happened. Maybe uh, they penalize you for actually sink, uh, losing your ship now, so uh, we can't afford the gun in the front anymore, any type of other decent weapon, so we've made some adjustments. we got a dual-mounted 40mm Bofors in the front. Oh, okay, 0.25 sink penalty. Okay, so... Okay, I see. 
that wasn't a thing back when I played originally. So we gotta be a little bit more careful now. These guys are going for a Tawifi. Let's go uh, intercept them, shall we? Oh, it's like it's two ships. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's a minesweeper and an armed merchant ship. This might be a war crime, but it's all right. There we go, go get them. And uh, that's this guy too. I right, missed him with the first torpedo. The second one looks like it's a little bit more armed. Hey, no need for that. There we go. All right, get him anyway, boys. Wow, they uh, they did not like that. Okay, all right. I think they're sinking. Just took the torp a second to take hold, maybe. Oh, why is no one on the uh? The Beaufort. Oh, okay, so the merchant ship did sink. Okay, just took him a second. Um, all right, so the torpedo did work. That's fine. Now we're gonna go bully the minesweeper. And those are our resource points in the water over there. We're gonna go grab them real quick. Juicy, juicy resource points. Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I ended up in this situation. We did get the tanker. Alright, boys, I need you to fix the boat. Oh, the boat has sunk. Oh, all that, all those points there, too. Dang. Okay, over here, you have, like, this fleet of ships and stuff that, uh, looks like they want to get involved in this fight. Well, I guess they kind of are, but we're going to go, oh, skirmish is over, I guess. Is this, like, one ship? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Nagara class. Ooh, let's see if we, if we can get a jump on this guy. Now, if we can approach undetected, we have four torpedoes. Maybe. According to this, my Q torpedo is on target. Go get him, boy. Okay, let's back off, see if those guys hit. I think we've been spotted. They launched aircraft. Ah. Huh. Ha ha. His dispersion sucks. Go, my child. Deliver us a... What was that? Deliver us a cruiser for our kill. Be so many resource points. Let's see if we can sneak in between one of these shells. Oh, I think we're going to hit him with one. We did. We tagged him on his stern a little bit. We can do it again. That's why you don't sell broadside, fellas. Uh-oh. Oh, I think we, we got out just in time. Torpedo number two. It's looking pretty good. I think it hit. It did it, but I don't really think he cared. I'm going to tweedle around here a little bit, see if he starts to sink. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I have made very poor choices. No! Oh, why would you spawn us running right into them? I ah, uh, this is beautiful. It's a minesweeper. Where's some like small boats that we can bully? There we go. Some landing ships. Let's go. Okay, that was uh. Not really a tough boat, was it? 
Apparently this one's a little bit tougher. The destroyer's getting lit up by a bunch of teeny tiny boats. Maybe we can jump him while he's distracted. There's a single destroyer left. I do have one torpedo left as well. Alright boys, we might be about to get ourselves a destroyer. Yep, we hit him with it. Yeah, we sunk him. We're just gonna serpentine away. Uh, we can go bully some of those smaller boats, though, with our machine guns. Alright, get them, boys. After I think this one last. There we go. Now we're completely out of ammo. And there they go. They finally got him. All right, we're gonna grab those re uh, resource points. And that's a successful uh, defense. All right, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and end the video there. Uh, yeah, just taking a look back at Boat Crew after the most recent big update. I think it's a pretty fun game. Uh, the gameplay loop is pretty satisfying, just takes a little bit of getting used to. Um, the graphics, I know last time some weren't too impressed by the graphics of the game, but like it's it's stylized, it works. It still looks fine in my opinion. I mean, it means you know, it can run on pretty much whatever machine you have at high settings uh, the way the graphics are you know designed so i think that's pretty neat but anyway guys let me know what you guys think in the comments down below hope you guys have a wonderful sunday wonderful rest of your weekend I hope to catch you guys in the next one